Hey, this is uh, Carolina Chris, a.k.a. High Tech Redneck, and uh, we're in Piedmont, North Carolina, and this is a swarm that I captured on uh, April the 17th that evening. It's kind of a late call I got that evening. Grabbed the swarm right before dark and uh, fortunately got it, the queen in the box on the first try, and everybody joined in and crawled right in, and I closed it up and brought it home. And I kept them locked down for almost 24 hours, opened them up uh, later the afternoon the next day on a Sunday. And when I opened them up, I just uh, opened the entrance reducer. So I left the reducer on it because we had several nights uh, coming up that had uh, some cold temperatures. And I knew this was a really large swarm, about 20,000 plus bees. Um, and I, I started this with a 10 frame box. And you can see when I'm popping the top here, the inner plywood cover that I had that I was sealing it up with was just covered with bees. All 10 frames were full. Um, I had started them out with uh, two frames of honey from a dead out that I had over the winter that I'd saved, as well as eight frames of drawn comb. So um, they had a good start. I'm sure they started cleaning that up. I did not do an inspection to that day um, when I'm expanding it here. Um, but all 10 frames were just covered in bees, so I knew I had to give them some space um, to give them some growth room. We're right in the beginning of our flow here, which is tulip poplar, clover starting to bloom, and blackberries are blooming. So I knew they were going to need some space. So I've got another 10 frame deep that I'm putting on here. Inside of it is also a couple frames uh, that have partial honey, and they've got uh, several drawn out frames, and then a lot with just base foundation. Um, but it is a full 10 frame deep that I put on top here. And uh, it was in pretty good shape, so I think they'll be able to start cleaning it up and working it right away. And I'll do another inspection on these guys in a few days once uh, everything um, kind of continues to warm up here. Thanks a lot for watching.